Adrian, I knew there was something special about you since our very first date. We went to go see the Hunger Games movie. Of course, for some reason, you're running just a little bit behind. And by the and by the time we got there, it was sold out. So, I'm just. Oh wow! Okay, all right, all right. Just I didn't realize. Okay. So you know, I'm this awkward high school kid, and I'm like, oh, I actually have to talk to her now. Uh, but for the next hour before the next showing, we had one of the greatest conversations about it. We talked about everything, things that are important, things that aren't important. And to me, it was just an, an amazing thing that I had never experienced before. Since then, we have spent many hours talking about important topics, silly ones, and created some of the best memories of my life. I promise to always love you and be there for you when you need me. But just as importantly, I promise to always have those good conversations with you about every topic under the sun. Your voice is the sweetest sound I've ever heard. It can make me happy when I'm feeling sad. It can make my entire day just way better. Um, the other day, we were in a uh, CVS, and we didn't know this, but we were there at the same time picking up last minute stuff for wedding. And she kind of says, Connor? And like, just, you know, fireworks, right? My, my whole day just got a lot brighter. And I turned around and was excited to see Adrian. Adrian, I'm so excited to continue our adventure together and have all those other conversations. <laughs> Connor, before I knew you, I prayed for you. I was at a middle school sleepover, maybe with Susan. <laughs> Susan was probably there. All the other girls had boy drama to share. They wanted to talk about who was dating who or who liked who, and I felt a little left out. After everyone went to sleep and the lights were out, I said a silent, quick prayer. But I asked for God, God for something beyond what those girls had to gossip about. I asked for love. I asked for the real thing, unadulterated and uninhibited. Just a few short years later, I had the amazing luck to be assigned to your pre-calculus class. <laughs> and you, God, gave me everything I asked for and more than I ever knew I could want. Stumbling, mesmerizing, incredible partnership. You have taught and retaught me the most important things there are to know those things which you seem to innately understand without trying. The relationship we've built brings me up higher than I ever could have been alone, and when I'm unmoored, it keeps me afloat. What we share reminds me of the romantic poets, but it was perhaps you, not Wordsworth, who most succinctly stated, every time I get to know you a little bit better, I feel like I'm getting closer to the best thing there is. Beyond all of those lofty things, I cherish the passing moments and days with you. I love morning coffees and hugs during our quarantine work from home. I love time spent with you on walks and our daily games of Jeopardy. I love holding your hand and making you laugh. Although it's rare, you're much funnier than I am. <laughs> Looking into my own future, I'm most excited to be a part of your team. So today, I promise to work at this with everything I have for all of the days that I have. I promise to support you as you supported me. I promise that this day and the nine years of days that we've spent together so far is only the firm foundation for so much more of what's to come.